Hello everyone, welcome to Specific Love. I just discovered a super simple paper rocket launcher and I want to show you how to make it. Watch this thing fly. See that? These things will easily shoot 50 feet or more. So let me show you how to make this. Alright, this is all you need to make it. First I got a piece of half inch PVC that's 12 inches. Now I painted it, you can leave it white if you choose. You need a 2 liter bottle. The PVC will slide snugly right into the 2 liter bottle. And then you make yourself a paper rocket out of some basic paper and tape. So simple. Well, let me show you how to make that paper rocket. All right, here's what you need to make your paper rockets. You need your pipe, you need some scissors, you need some tape, and some scrap paper. This just happens to be seven by nine and a half. It does not have to be that size. That's what I had on hand. And you take your paper and your pipe and you need to, to roll your paper extremely tight over your pipe here. You only need about one layer, so just get one roll started. Take your scissors and cut it off. It does not have to be a perfect cut. This is just your base. Take some tape, throw it over the edge here to keep it down, and you can double check yourself. This should be barely able to slide over the pipe. It should be very tight. Now you take your second piece of paper, and you want to make sure you roll it on top of your first. It has to be on top of the first or it will not work. And you want it to keep it as even and as flush on the edges also. You don't want to have any weird pieces hanging off the edge. Take you some tape. Throw it on there. Now, once you have that done, you can slide your top piece of paper roughly a half inch, like so, off of the end of the PVC pipe. Fold it all in. Then take some more tape, throw it over the ends here. And one piece of tape should work, but if you want to put more, that's fine too. Take your second piece of paper, the one that you initially cut off, and you want to fold it in half. Use your scissors to cut you a large triangle. Now you've just created the wings for your rocket. Come over here, when you line it up on your rocket, make sure that your wings are straight up and down or it create a bad curve as you're shooting it. Take your tape, you wanna put it near the front of your wings here and as you do that, it will just naturally pull the wings inward as you see right there. Now, if they're too far in, you can always take your fingers, slightly crease them a little bit and they'll go flatter. But that's it, that is the paper rocket. What you do now is you pull the paper rocket off, take your inner layer that you created and you can discard of it, put your rocket on and you're ready to go fire. We're gonna have fun making these. As you can see, I've made a bunch. We're about to have some fun.